setting up modern practices. Well, the takeaway out here at this program was so unique that I could see that there is a cliff from the intelligent quotient to the emotional quotient. A one is to 5,000 difference. And then the movement is towards the spiritual quotient, which we all are spiritual human beings. Thank you. Thank you, Nitin. Thanks for being here. Karen, my friend Karen here, does a lot of work for NGOs, promotes the products made by the NGOs, which definitely do a lot of good to the people supporting the NGOs. Karen. Rajesh, thank you very much for inviting me for the program. It was excellent, as always, your choice. Um, I think, you know, this is just reinforced how I believe that people look for methods and channels to really create impact in the world around them. And we all want a better world, we all want a greener planet, and I think that's what iDobro tries to achieve, is to provide those channels and marketplaces for people to buy products and services that can create that impact, both social and environmental. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you, Karen. My friend Deepan, my colleague at the Excel Foundation, he would like to share a few words. Yeah, just thanks for having this seminar on Excellent. And I think that amongst all the noise that we keep on hearing about marketing and brand building, what we learned today was a few comments and simple ideas, a few words of wisdom. Something I think which we always knew, but when it comes from my the way it was presented and the way it is uh, understood, I think it made a big difference uh, to how perhaps we would approach uh, branding or marketing. Fantastic. Thank you, Deepu. Thank you. Shashwat Banerjee, one of the most intelligent people around in the business of accounting and a very dear friend. Shashwat, we would like to have a statement from you. You know what I actually learned today? If you want the brand and you want it to be convincing enough, it has to follow your passion. Otherwise, you cannot stand that and stand by the band brand behind it. That's what I learned most from today. Thank you, Shashwat. Joe, we would like to have your comments as well. A person with a personal brand, the way he dresses is his brand. And he has a wonderful beard, he has painted it white. He's a young man. And now we would like to hear from Joe Pereira. Roderick. Roderick, sorry. That's my brand. <laughs> uh, thank you very much. I'm just winding down one career. And uh, being with Mike today, he's got a marvelous way of teaching and getting things across. Has given me a tremendous burst of energy. And also showed me a very clear direction. And I'm sure in keeping in touch with people like Agnello and the others in Excel, Going together. We are there together. Same I light. Know. I know. Yes. My friend here, who has come the way, Mr. Ramesh, I would like to hear your experience as well. Well, I have a travel magazine and I've been to travel and I'm feeling probably that this uh, country needs a magazine which is very important but I've never ever felt that it needed so much for branding and I got to understand that passionate is one thing but getting this passionate right to across the people and making them feel passionate about it and exchanging whatever, they, whatever you have, they should feel the same need and the urge to have that magazine. So I feel probably that branding is very important personally not only for me but also for the entire country. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. Thank you, Ramesh. My friend Ralph is uh, going to take a long way to walk up to here, but I'm sure he also has enjoyed the session today. And here is Ralph. We can hear a few statements from him as well. Hi, Rajesh. I should thank Rajesh for getting uh, my good call over here. It's a great Pleasure. thing there. It's great to get him over here, and especially for you to sponsor this guy over here. I heard about company branding for the first time. We're hearing really about personal branding, and especially things that we have, that have become today is about culture and a uh, lot of other things that go into personal branding. Anyway, all the best. Thank and you, Ralph, for being here. And get people uh, like Mike to India. Thank you. Thanks for And the next gentleman here is a very interesting person, a very intelligent friend, who has got sharpness as sharp as the moustache that he shows around these days. Cool. So, personal branding has been a you know, very impactful uh, area where uh, my Knowledge related to brand was just about brand building and brand communication. But personal branding was uh, totally new kind of knowledge that I got today. And uh, so much of you know insights that I got about organization culture, with finding out your unique ability and working on the passion and uh, you know uh, how we can basically live a value-based life and uh, leverage out of the resources. So those are the of key concepts that I got today and it was very kind of Rajesh to organize and support uh, such events so uh, really thankful for uh, him to have such an event organized and supported and thank
thanks Mike for such a fabulous knowledge sharing. Thank you. Thank you, Tushar. And by the time Advocate Parimal Shah comes up over here, I would like to share my experience as well that this has been a wonderful learning session on personal branding. It will go a long way in making each one of us more successful than what we were till today. Uh, Mr. Parimal Shah is on the way and uh, we would like to hear what he has to say, one take that he has from today's session. Parimal Shah. It was a great uh, privilege to be exposed to a great brand called Mike uh, and Kong. Kong. And, Kong. and uh, really, it has awakened uh, me to the need for proactive approach to managing our own personal brands. I'm sure it will help me. Thank, Thank you. you. I would like to invite my colleague Nandini Shah here on what uh, she would like to say on this wonderful experience. I'm sure she will also be very happy for adding some more interesting knowledge to her personality. Yes, Tanay. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, for inviting me. It's such a beautiful event. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. This event is, you know, like uh, what uh, Mike said today about Mike. It's uh, something that really triggered me and it really impressed me. Because uh, what had happened in the past is was an education field and from there I went into uh, auditing which was a reliance retail and from there I thought that no, this is not what I am and why am I here? And it again got me back into the education field and I again thank you once again for you know letting me be a part of you know St. Andrews Computer Education. I am very proud of it. Promoting this with a lot of passion. Your pleasure is all ours to have you with us, Nandi, and I wish you all the best with us. Thank you, dear. I will also invite Mr. Kishore Pardesi, a very old time associate and a strong pillar for St. Angelo's Computer Education. Kishore Ji, what would you like to say? So today, the relation between heart and uh, mind is with Clipper Mike to apply to the brand application and the uh, promotion of our own uh, strategy of the career, the growth and all. And same thing, I can, I can tell you, I am blessed to have such a dynamic and spontaneous, intelligent chairman manager of the organization. Thank you. I, I, I pray for God to have the, the, the summit and the growth of this company. To the Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Mr. Thomas. And uh, we have our dear friend who is also a personally good trainer, a personal trainer, Maya over here, the second Maya.